Brothers and sisters, President Nelson has asked that I handle the business of the solemn assembly for which we are gathered today. This is an occasion of great significance for members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints throughout the world. Dating from October 10, 1880, when John Taylor was sustained to succeed Brigham Young as Prophet, Seer, and Revelator, and President of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, each of these occasions has been designated as a formal, solemn assembly of the body of the Church to express the voice of the Church. We will vote by quorums and groups. It is proposed that the First Presidency sustain Russell Marion Nelson as Prophet, Seer, and Revelator, and President of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Those of the First Presidency in favor, please manifest it. It is proposed that the First Presidency sustain Dallin Harris Oaks as First Counselor and Henry Benyon Eyring as Second Counselor in the First Presidency of the Church. Those members of the First Presidency in favor may manifest it. It is proposed that the First Presidency sustain as members of the Quorum of the Twelve Apostles M. Russell Ballard, Jeffrey R. Holland, Dieter F. Uchtdorf, David A. Bednar, Quentin L. Cook, D. Todd Christofferson, Neil L. Anderson, Ronald A. Rasband, Gary E. Stevenson, Dale G. Renland, Garrett Walter Gong, and Ulysses Suarez. We invite Elder Gong and Elder Suarez to take their places with the Quorum of the Twelve.